Hello everybody, it's a me, and today we are going to have fun with this. Yeah, if you don't know what these are, check out my recent Shopping with Unfriendly Porcupine episode. Right there, you'll know exactly what they are. Or, I can just tell you right now, they're actually Mega Constructs Blind Bags Construction. So, Mega Constructs Construction, no, Mega Constructs Construction Yellow Vehicle Beanie Balls. Ay, my goodness. My mouth twisting is going crazy, but yeah, today we're going to have fun with these. Yes, they are the Wonder Builders. There are six different ones, but I only bought three. And on top of that, this is also going to be a review. So, what's the first thing that we need? We need to get scissors. Okay, now, let the fun begin with the first one. You wanna know what's the funny part? I don't need scissors, because these ones have a little opening that I can just do this. <laughs> Stupid and friendly porcupine strikes once again. Ooh, but isn't that nice? They provided you a little tiny rubber band over here. Very tight instructions. Ooh, okay, baby, let's build them up. Hmm, okay, nice, nice. So we have this one. Let's actually open up the rest of them. We have this one. Okay, let's see who's in here. Oh, -ho. okay, baby, okay. Oh, now these pieces, these pieces right here are valuable. Mm -hmm. Absolutely good stuff over here. Oh, we have another one of these. Well, okay. <laughs> That's interesting. I'm not complaining. This is good stuff. Let's see what this one is. Aha, it's this one once again. So I got two of the same ones. Well, who could have thought? Let's see what this one is, the left and final one. Cool. Interesting. Ooh. Well, would you look at that? Okay. Let's see what it actually is. Doink, 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 doink. Aha! The cool one. Okay, excellent. And now it is going to be time for the building process. So let's build them up with the first one. Let the Mega Constructs construction begin. Here is build number two, which is literally the same thing. And here is the last build. Alright, I have finished building them. So, of course, two of them are the same one. We'll move this aside and use this one for review. So, how is the playability over here? Well, first of all, you get wheels. So, wheels automatically make it more playable. Number two is they can rotate, which is very excellent. Plus, these are the type of wheels for, like, if you want monster truck sized wheels for your skateboard. Let's actually test that out real quick. You know what? Let's do it with the ATV since I forgot where the skateboard was. Let's try it out. Okay, there's not enough space for you. <laughs> Damn, bruh. Look at that. Just look at that. And then whatever you do, vice versa. <laughs> oh. Yeah, anyways. That's the type of fun you can have with these little tiny mini builds. And of course with this one, you can move this thing. And it moves well. Also, this type of piece. So you get a silver rocket piece. You know, the rocket exhaust piece or the Destiny one. Just in silver color. And it makes such a good drill. It's a really good one. Anyways, moving on to the next build. Which is this build. 
Which is, if you want to call it, Mini Mr. Slam! <laughs> I really like the aesthetics of it, like, you can really tell what it is. This one, uh, I mean, it, it looks okay. But this one on the other hand, this one has been done very well. Like, I really, really like the aesthetics. Plus, you also get the tiny skateboard wheels to go along with it. So if these humongous wheels are a little bit too big for you, you get the skateboard ones. On top of that, you also get the care package piece. Yeah, baby. In yellow color. So if you had two of these and you don't like this build, well, now you can have yellow colored care package pieces. And of course, with the glass pieces, here yeah, the glass piece was actually not super extremely... Okay, never mind then. <laughs> well, okay, it, it's a bit of an improvement from last time. It's still, it's still tight, however. Anyways, enough of that, it is time for final judgment. Now for the final judgment, which is my favorite part of the video, I don't have them all and that will be okay, I'll just judge for what I have over here. So, may the final judgment commence! For the aesthetics, I give this set an 8 out of 10. This one is really really good in aesthetics, however this one is just okay, mediocre. I mean it does the job, so... Yeah, so you have some that are really good and others that are, well, they're just mediocre. For the playability, I give the playability a 9 out of 10. I mean, I can already have a lot of fun with these. I mean, this thing is actually fun. You can swing it around. You can knock it out over here. Come on, ATV guy. Yeah, you can already also customize this, so that already gives you a lot of playability. Plus, if you also care, you also get these type of ropey pieces over here, which can add on more playability, especially if you want to, like, lock someone up, like have a rope tied behind their wrist or something. Those pieces can be useful, even though they're not official pieces, but whatever, they come in the instruction, they wrap it up. On top of that, this piece right here with the little drill piece, it's a very valuable piece for drills and other stuff, so having a very easy way to get that is good. Plus the wheels, the wheels add a lot of playability to the set, or the, to the set as a whole. For the value, I give the value a 7 out of 10. I believe these retail for $3, but I'm not exactly sure. It might also be two. I mean, for me, I got them for one dollar, so to me, the value is personally very high. But I believe the value for these were like three dollars. I mean, overall, it's standard value. You get what you paid for. Especially if you get this one, it just depends. Which one you like more is the one that gives you more value. I personally think this one gives me the most amount of value because you get the little one and the big wheels, and plus you get this very cool piece. But yeah, that's of course subjective, but so far here, the value is standard, and yeah, there it is. Last but not least, for the build, uh, I give the build an 8 out of 10. I think the build here was okay, it does the job, it's better than what knockoffs build, absolutely. I just think this one, this is the thing that really really shines in its build. Specifically this one, so some of them are mediocre, other builds are really really good, so it just depends on what you have. And everybody, the moment you have been waiting for, roll the super crazy snare drums of military... Okay, that's not the sound I make, but the final score is an 8 out of 10. It's a B. Well, my comrades, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to leave it a like, and as always, my comrades, if you want to see more content from me and Friendly Porcupine, such as these Mega Constructs, Constructs, Yellow Thingies, Vehicles, Bills. Yeah, this thingy. And of course, my comrades, if you want to see more videos from me, you know what to do. Hit subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next video, my comrades. Take care, everybody. Oh, no. It didn't do anything. Look, look how super strong this little thing is. Look, look, look. We're playing Twisted Metal. Twisted Metal Small Brawl versus Real Twisted Metal. Okay, okay. All right, little fella. Twisted Metal versus Twisted Metal. Wait. Mr. Slam versus... Knock off Mr. Slam. Who isn't Mr. Slam at all? Oh, no, no. They got two of the little what? Well... I guess math has 
What? Math is the victor! <laughs> so, Math, what do you wish for? Ah, you want me to solve your problem? Well, that's your problem! God, I'm having a mega contract over here, more fun! So get out of here, calculator! Do you get it? Calculate it? Because I will calculate it! <laughs> the quiz! The quiz is acting! <laughs> I'll calculate! <laughs> no! No fucking way! <laughs> How about ITI? Okay, okay, at this point it's late. 